This is the Quantum Edge 3. This is this chair is only a few months old. This power chair is in brand new condition. It was used less than a month. Uh, so this is the Quantum Edge 3, the newest power chair that just came out with the newest base. And you can tell it's the newest because the uh, the color here matches the uh, the color of the chair. So it's a beautiful blue color. It also has light. It has a captain's seat. So it's a gorgeous power chair. Uh, the first thing I want to show you is the, uh, let's talk about the base first. The base here, as you can see, it's a beautiful base. We've got 14 inch black wheels, non-skid wheels with caster wheels in the front, caster wheels in the back. Again, all Quantum Edge have the super anchor points, two, one in the front, one in the back, two on each side. You've got a motor for each wheel, so if you need to roll this chair around, right now you can't do it, it's in gear, you can see the suspension. If you turn the power off, push the lever down, what that does, it unlocks the gear from the wheel. You got to do both motors on both sides, then you can push the chair around, okay? This puts it back into gear, turn your power back on, and you're back on. You've also got lights on the fenders right here, you can't hardly see them. But right over here, under this arm, you can see the pad. If I hit that pad, you can see the lights on the chair. I'm going to put the arm back down. I'm going to turn the chair. You can see the front lights. You can see the LED lights in the front. And you can see the LED. You can see in the front how the light, the chair will light up outside. And you can see the red lights in the back. So again, the lights for this chair the light button is right here, tap it one time, your lights are on, your lights are off. So you do have that. This is a mid-wheel drive power chair. This chair will turn around around its own length. So if I put a box in front and a box behind, I can turn this chair all day long like this in a circle without moving. So I could do this all day long. You have an adjustable foot plate. Right now the foot plate is out as far as it can go forward. When you flip it up, you have a little bit of obstruction here. So if you want the foot plate to move back, there's this much, there's two holes left. You can move the foot plate back to about here, which would put the foot plate here when you get out. Okay. The batteries in this chair always come out from the front. There's two batteries in here, group 22, and they're 55 amp batteries. You'll get about 13 to 15 miles on a battery charge. And it always depends on where you're riding the chair, the weight of the user, and what kind of surface you're on. So everybody gets a different uh, distance, but if you're an average sized person on a flat surface, the first year at least when the batteries are new, you will get your 13 to 15 miles in distance. You can see the suspension right here on this chair. The suspension is adjustable by turning the ring. We can tighten up these springs. You have the suspension in front. And you have the same suspension in the back, right here, that's adjustable by turning this ring, okay? You've got a pocket here on this seat, so you're going to keep your manual there. The arms do go up, and they go up, and they can also go out if you need more width. This is a swing-away joystick, that means you can swing the joystick away from the front. If you're left-handed, we can switch this to the left side. You've got a safety belt. You've got a super heavy-duty cushion. It's not, it's not hard. It's a real nice contoured cushion, for, and it's got a contoured. It's a synergy. Uh, it's a true comfort cushion. Real nice cushion. And this is a floating cushion, so if you want to remove the cushion, just pull it off the chair. It sits on Velcro. That's, a, that's the noise you just heard. Uh, the seat is 8, 18 by 9, I'm sorry, 19 by 19 is the seat size. We cannot change the depth of this chair. This seat is a captain's seat. We can, you can flip the back down forward like this. So the highest point would be right here, which is about 32 inches right here. As a matter of fact, so if you're going to transport this chair, you can take your headrest off, and your highest point would be 32 inches. So right here is 32 inches. So this will go into most vans, most SUV. So your seat on this chair, we cannot adjust this seat. So if you want this seat, this chair, it'll come with this seat right here. Again, 
This is the Q Quantum Edge 3. When you charge this chair, like all quantum chairs, take your quantum charger, plug it in the bottom of your joystick. When the light goes from orange to green, you're fully charged. The charger will stop charging automatically. So, this chair has a fantastic suspension. As I said, it's only a few months old. It's the latest in technology. The last uh, Quantum 3 chair they just built. Uh, it's the latest model. So if you're looking for a power chair that's got kind of quite, quite a bit of speed, from five and a half to six miles an hour, and it has a real nice captain seat that's adjustable, arms that flip up, anchor point, great suspension, adjustable foot plate, swing away joystick. Uh, this chair is, is as new as you're going to get, and it's really, really classy looking. And as I said, this is a real nice one. The Quantum Edge 3, the newest power chair they came out with this year. Um, fantastic. The suspension, again, is unbelievable. When I went through the grass, it barely bumped. It, it's great. The suspension is even better than the ones before. So, six miles an hour top speed over here. Uh, very easy to drive. I had it on the full speed. If you put it on speed number one, it barely moves on speed number one. And it's very easy to drive. You can see this. It has no response on speed number one. So if you go from one to six, it'll go from almost not moving to six miles an hour. So if you're learning how to drive it, you can put it on one. And as a matter of fact, I think it's too slow on one, but this is number one. So that's about creeping speed. Um, probably speed number two would be your learning speed. Let me see speed number two. Yeah, speed number two is a little bit better. But when you get up to speed number five, that's when you're going to have six miles an hour. Fantastic chair. The joystick is very easy to drive. It doesn't respond very fast. So great chair. I'm going to put it back on speed number five, and, and it's ready to go. Hi, I'm Mark. And my name is Alex. We are a family-owned business for over 25 years. We have many products available, not just what you see in this video. If you would like to learn more, you can call the number below at 800 Six seven seven six two nine three, or you can visit us directly at www.marksmobility.com.